Hi guys, welcome back to another video. I am testing the 12.5.4 today. This is the latest FSD update. It also comes with the actual Smart Summon. I did post a video yesterday about the uh, testing of actual Smart Summon. So if you haven't checked it out already, you can check that out on my channel. But we are going back to our regular testing. Uh, there were a lot of issues with the previous version, previous two versions I would say of FSD. Uh, including hard breaking phantom breaking which was brought back again for some reason and then a uh, few other things where fst was not following the navigation and stuff so this update came right within the two week time span of that last update so i'm expecting that things have improved but we'll find out in today's video so if you haven't already please consider subscribing check some other content out on the channel as well and provide me with your feedback in the comment section down below i try to keep these videos uncut so that so that you can uh, see exactly what happened in a certain scenario so with that being said let's just start our review so we are going to be approaching a stop sign very shortly and look at this so a car is coming here so our car just did what i would have done move to the right so that the other car could go uh, it didn't stop on these well, the previous speed bump it did on this one so something I would like to mention okay so we are approaching a stop sign as you can notice the braking is very subtle soft and it's taking its time not a lot of time though and we are moving the move is also not like abrupt it's uh, you know very gentle and slowly gradually started moving at the other speed bump we slowed down a little bit for this okay another speed bump is coming and FSC didn't slow down for this one either. The markings are clear on the road as well. So, but these speed bumps are, you know, not like uh, huge speed bumps. Okay, so we are gonna be approaching another stop sign. This is a good kind of dust, another speed speed bump coming up and FSD it did not slow down for this either okay so it's happening repeatedly as you guys have seen it's slowing down for some of the speed bumps but not for all okay so we have approached a stop sign car is slowing down perfect moving forward And we made a left turn here now, so see. Okay, so this one is slowing down for this. Perfect. Speed limit is 25 here. And automatic set speed offset is on. And it's deciding to go at 31. Which is fine. Uh, the car in the front is also, I think, going at a similar speed. Okay, so we're gonna be making a right turn from here. There's no stop sign for us, so we are going. Fine, we did not stop, so perfect. Changing the lanes very naturally perfect i would have done the same uh just a thing guys i always mention in all of my videos this is still a supervised uh, fsd so please make sure that you're ready to take over at any time so approaching a stoplight So as you notice like it's very slow gradual and now it's picking up 
gradually as well so amazing and I'm on the aggress assertive settings on the uh, FSD profile assertive is the most aggressive FSD setting so so far so good and I have, I have historically noticed that it works better on the plaid um, you know if you're a model Y or you know X or other cars you may want to play around with that and see what is the best option that is like best working for your car so on the model S plaid assertive works perfectly fine okay so going through the light and approaching another light but it's, as you can see it's green so it just slowed down a little So far, no hard braking or phantom braking that I've noticed. That I complained about in my previous videos about FST. So far, so good. So I'm testing it in more more on local roads because there are a lot of stop signs, stop lights, and stop and go kind of traffic. That's where FSD really shines, right? So for these daily trips, going to work, going to a local like place or anywhere, you know, you don't have to touch the yoke at all. Just sit behind the wheel and pay attention and it should be good. Now with the, this version of FSD, they said like, you know, attention monitoring system will work even with the sunglasses on. So let's test that too. Okay, so sunglasses. I'm gonna wear it on. And I do see a construction sign too, detour. Let's see if perfect. So we are changing lanes, we're fine. I'm wearing the glasses right now, guys. Sunglasses. Although it's not sunny, but just for the sake of testing this, as you can see, there's no warning here. Tension monitoring system is still working. I'm going through a construction kind of zone, so the, the car is reacting perfectly fine. No abnormal behavior. I'll take the glasses off. Perfect. Out of the construction zone and change the lane again. mentioned uh, that try not to change the direction halfway through your trip uh, I know I did that in previous videos just to see how FST would react but I do agree with that comment you know let the FST take you from one destination to the other if let's say you are changing uh, the directions uh, you know just do it in a way that like you know there's no uh, you know right away like turns or anything or like FSD have to react right away right so it'll take a little bit of time so make sure that you give it a little bit of time otherwise you will end up seeing some issues that I have noticed uh, it, it is maybe because of that I'm not sure but that's one of the comments and one of you guys have suggested that so I do agree kind of with that feedback but again, it was done all for the sake of testing. Okay. This is a very nice kind of uh, road and trip today so that, you know, we can definitely test out some of the things about this 12.5.4 version. As you can see, a lot of stoplights, stop signs, and a lot of stop and go kind of traffic. Still didn't, uh, you know, notice any hard braking. Um, so I'm really happy with that. So also let me know what version of FSD are you guys on. I am uh, on hardware 4. And, you know, this is like 12.5.4, which is the latest, latest version of FSD. Okay, so we are going to be making a left turn from 
here so the car very gradually changed the lane came in the perfect left only lane Just adjusting the camera a little bit, I took it off because I was making a video about the actual smart summon, so I had it back here. I will be testing a few more things around the actual smart summon, so I just used it for the first time and made a very quick video. You can see that as I mentioned on the channel, but uh, you know, I, I want to test it in a more uh, kind of a traffic kind of scenario and see how it reacts so that will be coming up in a few days or yeah, I'll cover that in my future videos okay so there's also no support for the pothole detection still so if you've noticed like we went over kind of a bump it was a gutter kind of thing driving really stable guys I am really liking it back to the 12.3.6 kind of feeling where it was nearly perfect and now this version on the 12.5 stack I think it's really good as well so look at this the car was turning our car slowed down again no harsh braking it was slowing down I didn't feel any harsh kind of Okay. Okay, so this will be uh, interesting. Let's see how FSD reacts here. Perfect. No confusions here on FSD's part and this is perfect as well so amazing so far guys i haven't experienced any issues except for some of the minor speed bumps where fsd did not slow down but other than that it's really working good i'm really happy so far i will be testing it more on different roads and scenarios too but uh, you know my initial impressions i am really impressed and i didn't have to touch the yoke at all even with the sunglasses on i didn't get any warnings about the tension monitoring system not working or anything like that guys I'm very close to my destination I think we have enough test footage let me know what you guys think about 12.5.4 I think all my complaints that were there in the previous versions majority of them are gone we did notice only a few times when uh, you know FSD did not slow down for the you know speed bump it was not like a big speed bump but um, you know there were a few times that happened so that's the only thing we noticed but overall I'm really happy it's a stable update and it's working really good as well so on that note I'm gonna see you guys in my next video please don't forget to subscribe share like all those good things stay safe and goodbye